Hey guys, Dylan here, and I just wanted to do a little another kind of different video, but this is at least anime related. And kind of, kind of just want to show what I kind of have at the moment. So let's start. This for the manga. As of right now, I have. The first two volumes of Noragami and The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. I am, and I know there is a third one out now for Zelda, and I'm waiting for my chance to get it. I have the first volume of Attack on Titan and Seraph of the End. Now, some of these I got through, actually, through a giveaway that. If I remember, it was three if by space. They did a giveaway, an anime and manga giveaway where I won, and it and I, that's where I got the first volume of Norgami, Attack on Titan, Surf of the End, Dead Man Wonderland, and Soul Eater, as well as the anime for Dead Man Wonderland and one of my choice, and I chose Steinscape. Because I've been wanting to watch it. And as you can see, I have all of Dead Man Wonderland. Mainly because since I have the anime and I've watched it, I want to know what actually happened afterwards since I doubt they would make another season. So I decided to just start collecting Dead Man Wonderland so I can fin finish it completely. And as you can see here, I have... Death, uh, the black edition of Death Note, the first volume. I'm gonna start cl and collect those eventually. And I'm starting to, and I'm gonna start collecting Soul Eater. As you can see that I have the second volume of Soul Eater now. And yes, I have Pocky there, but that's just to, to separate the manga and the light novels. Which, as you can see, it's man, it's more sort of online than anything. The other one here is the a certain magic a certain magical index, which I've watched the anime anime. I'm waiting for a third season, and I did not buy that. I someone mainly actually gave it to me, but I, maybe I'll plan to read the light novel of it. But as you can see from that bookmark up here. I have read up to the to volume eleven of Sword Art Online. So I'm definitely caught up through the anime, but I'm definitely not gonna get caught up through the next anime because unless they release them all right before it, all the volumes right before it, then no, because there's up to volume 18 for that and that's I doubt oh they're all gonna be released before then because it's because it starts at starts this year the third season which is gonna be all of this arc here Alice Alicization arc which is from volume 9 to 18 anyway Let's go down to the end. That's all the manga that I have and light novel that I have right now. Let's go to the anime, which as you can see right now, I have the Attack on Titan first season, second season, junior high, the spinoff. I have the two live actions. And now, and then for that, I have Black, Black Butler. I have all what has been released so far. The first season, second season, third season, and the Book of Murder OVA. I'm waiting for Book of Atlantic to be released. Next, we have Blood Lad, which I just I literally found that in Walmart. I was just like, screw it, I'm gonna buy it because it's like ten bucks. I've already I have already seen Blood Lad, but I just wanted to own it. Next is Codebreaker, which I actually got for Christmas, I believe. After that, I have a a one of the save 
anime, which is the super amazing value edition of anime. This is Corpse Princess, which I forgot how much I paid for it. It's, it's, it's always less than $30 for a whole anime season or series. So I think it was like, this one was like less than 20 bucks. But it was an enjoyable anime. Next is Cowboy Bebop the movie, which I dug through a freaking, t freaking, uh, I don't know what's called, a bin of a bunch of other Blu-rays at Walmart to find this because I knew it was there. You know, it cost me, what, like seven something? So I was like, screw it. I'm, I'm going digging for it. Next is date is the first season of Data Live, which I still need to get the second season. Like I'm, and like I said before, I have the Dead Man Wonderland uh, anime series. Next is if hard to see there, Death Note, the Omega edition, which includes the pilot manga, which was the one manga that was pitched before the manga ever started. Which is actually pretty cool and actually read it. It's not that it ain't that bad. Next is of course my favorite fairy tale. I am slowly starting to slowly getting there. And actually about this one, about this to this one five, yeah five to eleven. We actually got through the library. They just literally gave it to me. No joke, they actually just gave it to me. I didn't have a Blu-ray player then, so I had to wait to be able to watch it. <laughs> Next is the... Then I got volume 16 after that. And then the first first movie... First movie and the second movie. I, this is the most recent thing I actually got. After that. Now, I, then there's a Fully Cooly here. Then Full Metal Alchemist, the 2003 edition. The movie that came after that, the OVA, the OVA collection for it. Then the movie that came, that's part of Brotherhood. Then there's Full Metal Panic, Gargantua, Ghost in the Shell Standalone Complex, the Ghost in the Shell live action. Guilty Crown, both uh, parts. Helsing, the original. The three uh, volumes of Hunter Hunter that has been released so far. The Hunter Hunter movie that I did a review on. The And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All seven seasons of Inu Inuyasha, plus the final act, plus the movies. Then I have K the anime, then the then the movie K Missing Kings, season one of My Hero Academia, a bunch of Pokemon movies. Seraph of the End, complete season one. Soul Eater, complete se complete season, complete series. Spice and Wolf, Steins Gate, the Steins Gate movie that came out. Sword Art Online, first season. Tokyo Ghoul, Tokyo Ghoul Route A, Vampire Night, got the movie Your Name, got the movie, got Yu -Yu, the two Yu Gi Oh movies that have been released as well. And since I'm running out of time on my phone here, I guess I'll leave it at this. So until the next video, bye.